the Smothers Brothers. I was on their show about a week before they were fired and kicked off, and uh, it was uh, the Easter show. They were dressed like bunnies. Do you know what I got in my egg, Pat? Huh? You know when we used to mess around with the eggs when we were kids? Yeah. Do you know what I got in my egg? No. Take a look. What do you think uh, that is? It's a troll. <laughs> no? That's what right. Is, what is it? What color? I don't know. It's bloop troll. Now, what I've got in here is someone, someone in our magic egg for Easter, who is a man who's very gentle, very beautiful guy, and he sings songs that mean a lot to, I think, to everyone. He was just last seen on um, Johnny Carson's show several times. There he is with Johnny. <laughs> Johnny's a dirty old man. Look at him. <laughs> And he has an album called The Thorn and Mrs. Rose's Side. Ladies and gentlemen, he happens to be in my egg, Mr. Oh, yeah. Biff Rose. bit I had to do on that show was like Elmer Fudd and aim a gun at Tommy and Dickie Smothers and you wascally wab I said I can't do this I can't aim a gun it's what are you kidding aim a gun it's enough to shoot bullets of words into your ears go whoa whoa and uh, so that I think made the technicians mad like uh, I was holding a production it was costing them money I wouldn't conform to aiming a gun at uh, you know the bunny rabbits and killing them and so I didn't, wasn't invited back, but then they weren't either because they were fired the next week by CBS for, I think David Steinberg did a controversial piece about God, which is so innocuous by the standards of these mother, I like to edit myself. Don't you like to do that when you know like there's a camera on and you say that, you know, that beep, shh. I like when they go like that, right? Like we'd be... Uh, the Jerry Springer show do that a lot. Because you know, when he said, when he called me, I was like, I was like, he called, I, I really don't see. <laughs> That's where language is going. So much for the Smothers Brothers. Tetragrammaton, the unspoken word for God. <laughs> 